Round four, the round of statements where you tell me whether that statement is true or false. Correct answer, two points. An incorrect answer, deduction of one point. If you don't know or you are not sure of the answer, don't answer because the points are precious. So just leave it. And the other two schools, if they think they know, they have the opportunity to press the bell. And if the answer they give is correct, two points. If it is incorrect, a deduction of one point. I start from Holy Child School. Coxus is a vestigial organ in humans. Yes, Mira. Mira. What's her name? Mirella. Mirella. Okay. Mm. Mirella, yes. True. It's true. Assin State College. Nail is a vestigial organ in humans. Yes, Godfrey. False. It's false. Achimoto School. Ted Mola is a vestigial organ in humans. True. It's true. A preamble. Mm -hmm. The point A, giving us negative 3, 3, is a solution of the inequality. The point A, giving us negative 3, 3, is a solution of the inequality. Holy Child School. Y squared greater than X squared. Yes, Mirella. False. It's false. As in State College, x squared minus 2xy plus y squared less than 36. Yes, Eliasu. False. It's false. Achimoto School, x squared plus xy minus y squared less than zero. Yes, Walter. True. Yes, it's true. <laughs> A preamble, two forces act concurrently. Two forces act concurrently. Holy Child School, the forces act in opposite directions. Yes, Mirilla. False. It's false. As in State College, the forces act in the same direction. Yes, Godfrey. False. It's false. Achimoto School, the resultant of the forces vanishes. False. It's false. <laughs> Holy Child School, butene always exhibits geometric isomerism. False. It's false. As in State College, if a butene has substituents, it exhibits geometric isomerism. False. It's false. Achimota, butene exhibits optical isomerism. False. It's false. Another preamble. When the dark period of a short day plant is interrupted by a brief exposure of light. When the dark period of a short day plant is interrupted by a short by a brief exposure of light. Holy Child School. The plant produces more flowers. Yes, Mirilla. 
False. It's false. As in State College, the plant produces flowers immediately. Godfrey. False. It's false. Achimota School, the plant turns into a long day plant. False. It's false. Holy Child School, the negation of a statement is always false. Yes, Mirilla. False. It's false. As in State College, if an implication is true, its converse is true. Yes, Godfrey. False. It's false. <laughs> Achimata School. If an implication is false, its converse is false. False. It's false. <laughs> Holy Child School. Long haul electric power transmission over power lines is preferably done at higher voltage. Mirilla. Yes. False. No. Assin State College. High voltage power transmission over power lines is preferred because high transmission voltage minimizes power losses by electromagnetic radiations. Yes, Godfrey. False. It's false. Achimata School. High voltage power transmission over power lines usually requires power transformers at generation station and distribution substation. True. It's true. The last set of statements were round four. Holy Child School. For a completely gaseous reaction, the equilibrium constant may be influenced by a change in pressure. Yes, Mirilla. True. No. Hmm. It's a false statement. As in State College, for a reaction at equilibrium, the addition of a catalyst does not influence the relative concentration of reactants and products. Yes, Godfrey. True. It's true. <laughs> Achimata School. For a reaction at equilibrium, the addition of a catalyst results in a lower activation energy for both the forward and backward reactions. True. It's true. <laughs> And that ends round four.